Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to another Grounded Update video where today we're hopping back into the public test server of 10.0 and we're going to be talking about a question that I've been getting from a ton of people and that is Sim, what are the new perks that got added to 10.0 and what do they do? So we are going to start today with not with mom jeans but we're actually going to start with one of the hidden ones that not a lot of people are able to find right now and that's because a lot of people just don't tend to let this happen to your character that often and that is is the Mithridates Mithridatism, I think is what it is called, how you pronounce it. I apologize if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but as it states right here, your body has been ravaged by the thrilling surge of poison cursing through you so many times that has built up a permanent immunity. So as you guys know, we already have a perk in the game called Fresh Defense. Now this is added to the game and what it does is it gives you a perk that says a plume of mint dust envelops and sends a cool wave of rippling through your skin, cells activate a freshness layer combine the sting of all stings and burns so you get a damage resist to all stings and burns in the game right and you get that by picking up a piece of mint well how you get mithridism or however you pronounce this um, <clears throat> you have to get poisoned over and over and over again Okay, and once you get poisoned over and over and over and over and over again, you slowly build up this resistance in the game that will allow you to get this perk that will make it so poison damage, aka from the Broodmother or from Wolf Spiders, will take less damage. This is a huge update when it comes to being able to fight things like Wolf Spiders and the Broodmother because the worst part about a Broodmother or the Wolf Spider is their poison damage. That is a lot of damage that comes from one bug. So being able to kill off some of this poison is a really cool thing. The other updated perk that got added to the game is called Mom Jeans. It says your vocal cords stretch to form a spiderling summoning motherly cries, aka when you are fighting, you get a perk called Mom Jeans after you kill the brood mother. That's how you unlock this one, okay? And when that happens, as you're fighting, it will summon little tiny spiderlings to fight at your side. I covered this in a previous video that I did that went over um, how to unlock all the different pets that are being added to Grounded, but um, this is kind of, it's not really like a pet, right? It's just like an ad that jumps in and helps you fight and then dies afterwards. But at the end of the day, while you're fighting, it will actually summon out a couple spiderlings, very rarely mind you, but it will summon out some spiderlings that will come to fight you just the same way that the ad spawn inside of the Broodmother boss battle but they will summon for you. This is a really cool perk and I really like that this was added. And in fact, the addition of these three together. So for instance, if you can combine mom genes and then you combine mithridism and and uh, and fresh defense, not, not, uh, not a reliable friend, but if you can combine these together, right? You are now quite deadly when it comes to fighting a wolf spider. Think about it. Now you are gonna have damage resistance, then you're going to have poison resistance, then you're going to have ads that are coming in and helping you fight, plus whatever damage you are doing and the bonuses off, off of your armor. This could make fighting wolf spiders so easy in the game that it's going to be just constant battling of wolf spiders. But the problem with this perk is, the problem with these perks is that they are hard to get. Now, fresh defense, easy to get, but you do have to kill a bombardier beetle and a stink bug in order to do it. But free fresh defense is quite easy to get because you only need a tier 2 hammer and as soon as you pick up the mint piece you're good to go but getting something like mom jeans or mithridism i mean this one this is a pain in the butt you have to go fight wolf spiders get poisoned and then just run away right constantly that's not easy that, that wolf spider venom is dangerous you have to keep a lot of healing items on you to fight back against the poison so you have to do this constantly to try to unlock this perk and I going off of what's normally in grounded it's probably anywhere between 15 and 30 times you need to be poisoned in order to unlock this I don't have an exact number for you guys but it's but somewhere between there going off of common uh, grounded logic so it's a lot of times that you're gonna need to get poisoned. Now, through playing the game and fighting things, you're probably going to end up um, dying from the poison. And I'm fairly certain that the poison guard, as you die from it, it still builds up slowly. So, you know, it's it 
there's a give and take. It might not be as hard as you think. It might just be going and getting killed by Wolf Spider 30 times. I'm not sure because I haven't just gone through and grinded this out other than being poisoned and healing myself. So I'm not, I haven't tested that part. Mom Jeans, on the other hand, fighting the Broodmother is no easy thing to do. Even on easy, she requires a lot of focused attention. I'm going to be making a video to show you guys the best ways to fight the Broodmother here in just a little bit. I hope you guys will like that video as well. Also, while we're at it, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to this video because I'd hate for you guys to miss any other grounded updates that are coming in the future. But guys, that's all the time that I have for this one. Thank you guys all so much for watching all the way to the end. And as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.